Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So it is a very big and exciting day for Jude today. I am currently sitting across the road from the orthodontic surgery and Jude is in there right now getting his braces fitted. Oh my gosh, guys, we've waited so long for this appointment. He was originally supposed to get his braces on back in March, but it was the literal same week as the whole world shut down. So we've, yeah, we've had to wait until now because I think the dentists were only open for like essential work and then they had a massive backlog. But we are just really thankful that he is now getting them on. Fingers crossed that they are able to function as normal going forward because we are going into another national lockdown tomorrow. <sighs> Gosh, guys, he has waited such a long time to get these braces fitted. Um, I think it's been like about a year and a half because um, he had to have four teeth taken out. But upon x-raying his mouth, they found that he had an extra tooth up in his palate, which required him to see an oral surgeon to have like surgery at a hospital rather than having his teeth removed at the dentist. So yeah, it's been a long drawn out road, which is why Elsie actually got her braces on before Jude, even though she was only 11. He's 12 now um, and Jude is 14 and a half but I'm sure it will all work out in the end. I'm just waiting for him to come out. Um, I have left the other children at home under the supervision of my near to be 16 year old, Jean. Um, I mean, when I was like 15, I think even 14, I was babysitting multiple children for money. So I know she's completely capable, but I think when it's your siblings, you might have a tad less patience. So we are home alone and we are super scared just joking i'm actually scared it was a joke um but yeah i'm just about to make the baby some breakfast it's gonna have to be something quite basic today so mum literally just ran to the shop and she got some cereal so i'm gonna make them some cheerios um we have got a shop coming later like loads of yummy food but you know like for now we don't really have that much food like we have porridge but I actually don't really like porridge. So I'm going to get some Cheerios and I'm also going to have some Cheerios. And then I need to do some work with them, like school work. Um, it is really hard to do work with them though because they don't always listen to me. or well, they really don't listen to me like ever. Like it's like one in a hundred times they listen to me. They listen to mum a lot more than me. Like sometimes they don't even listen to mum though. But they listen to mum more than they listen to me um but yeah i'm gonna do some work with them if they will do it they're playing right now like just playing in the front room um and then after what well, if they do their work with me then i'll just like do the, all their work with them and if they don't do it i'm just gonna like do my work and i also want to have a bath oh here's jude i can see him he's coming i can't wait to see what it looks like it's a busy road like there's a there's traffic lights down there and he's standing there He's going to cross, but not on the traffic lights. Yeah, he's doing it. Here he is. How is it? Weird. Does it hurt? No, it just feels really weird. <laughs> Do you feel like you can't talk? Yeah. And you feel like you have to put your lip over your, over yeah. your braces. What colour? I didn't, I didn't get to pick. That's silver. That's what Elsie got. Mm. They look fine. They look good. Smile. Oh my gosh. I don't like them. Don't you? No. It takes a while to get used to it. You'll like the results. Yeah. There's weird. no pain at all? No. Nothing? No. <laughs> they will start to hurt a bit more. Essential braces pack. Woo! You're joining Elsie now. Two children with braces. Jude's just had the top layer put on and in three weeks time he'll get the bottom ones on. They don't do them together. I, I remember when I had mine put on, they put them both on together and I was in, I couldn't even like, I couldn't do, I couldn't even suck a straw. It was so painful. They're a bit kinder nowadays. It took her a real long time to do this one because the teeth's missing. So she had to do it for ages. So she's probably going to have to change it on the next one. Yeah, move it around. Because Jude chipped his tooth coming when he came off his bike. That was a long time ago now, wasn't it? Mm. Guys, I have just had an email from my online shop to tell me that 30... 30 of my items are unavailable and they do not have any substitutions. I mean, I know everyone's just trying to do their best right now, but those items were the staples for the meals I've planned for the next six days. So I'm going to have to now pop to the supermarket. Um, do you want to come in? And then you can choose some soft things to yeah, eat. Yeah, sure. You won't be, because no matter what you think, dude, you're not going to be biting into apples or carrots or any of that, like for the next couple of days. It's going to be worse tomorrow. Yeah. So choose some soft things. Yeah, so we're going to, we're gonna head to the supermarket now. Um, I'm just gonna quickly phone Jean to make sure everything's okay. Jean's been ringing me and talking about GCSEs. 
Um, she's worried they're not going to go ahead. Hi, is everything okay? Yeah. Alright, bye. See you soon. Bye, bye, bye. So guys, here I have got a jar of jalapenos and a fork so I can obviously get them out. And as you most of you guys might know, I have kind of gone off spicy food. Like it's just like been burning my mouth a lot recently. But I feel like that I could start liking spicy food again because I just really feel like spicy food for some reason. So I'm gonna call Max up and we're both gonna eat jalapeno and see if you can keep a straight face. So I am just gonna call him. Max! Come! Do a new challenge. What challenge? <laughs> no, 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 I'll try, I'll try that. I feel like, is this the same size? No, it's a bit bigger. I'm not yeah, yeah. having a big one, it has to be the same size. I can't think how we use head of hundreds actually. Oh, these are so strong. Wait, they're strong? Oh, they smell really strong. Okay. Like spiciness. Okay. <laughs> this is going to be so oh, hard for me. Three. three. Wait, 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 wait. What did you say? <laughs> okay. Three. You know, whoever makes like a face like, okay. or even, yeah. Like that, okay? Three, two, one. Guys, <laughs> 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 well, watering, guys. It's not that bad, you know? <laughs> I'm not taking that one then. No, 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 I'm not taking that one. I'm not taking that I one. I dare you. Ah, I was disgusting. Don't one. No, I need a drink. I'm just gonna go get a drink and carry my work, so see you later. Yeah, some soy milk because apparently milk makes spiciness go away. So let's go have some soy milk. So we have actually come straight home. Dad has said that he will pick up the missing pieces from the shopping for me and also get some bits for Jude, who is actually admitting now that it's starting to hurt, right? Yeah, he's like, I've got a bit of a headache. Can we see? Oh, you've only got them on the top. Yeah. yeah, he's gonna get he's gonna get them on the bottom. Okay. Do you like the juice? They're black. They're not they're black, they're, they're silver, they're the same as Elsie's. Oh yeah. Do you like them juice? Let's have a look then, both of you together. Smile, Jude. <laughs> Elsie's mouth looks like way more filled with metal because she's got top and bottom there. Yeah. So I just bought myself a new cup with straw um, to hopefully um encourage myself to drink more water because i don't like to drink i like to drink things through a straw Let me get the lid off it's like 750 ml so it's nice and big i'm just going to fill it back up now and i'm going to try and drink two of them minimum because i do drink like herbal teas and teas and coffees and i know that they don't add like teas and coffees don't but like herbal teas do add to your liquid yes ollie some scissors. Say, so can I have some scissors, please, Mummy? Have some scissors, please. I don't know where the little ones have gone. I don't know, it just feels better drinking through a straw than through a cup. Plus, everyone knows this is mine. Don't touch it. Mine. Show everybody how handsome you are. It's my doggy. How's it feeling now? My jaw and that's starting to hurt a bit. What about your head? 
Yeah, I've got a headache too, all around that area is hurting. You taking paracetamol? Yeah, I've took two. Have you sent any pictures to anyone? Everyone's at school. Oh, are they? Yeah. Are you excited to keep them on? No. You have straight teeth. I had braces. I can't wait to have straight teeth, but well, what you had braces like? when you were 14, didn't you? Same age as you. I had braces when I was 14, and the problem with me is I forced them to take them off early. I just couldn't cope anymore. They said, you need a bit longer, and I was like, no, nah, get them off. <laughs> get them yeah. off. I don't know. I regret it deeply. I mean, my teeth aren't aren't terrible, but they, they're not as good as they could be. So honestly, keep them on until they tell you to and wear your retainer, something that Jean didn't do. And I mean, Jean's teeth are still really nice, but they have moved, haven't they, yeah, Jean? Yeah, they have. They've definitely moved. And I had to get a new retainer. Yeah, because the retainer didn't fit anymore. Yeah, so they have moved quite, well, not quite a bit, but you know, it's still annoying. I still regret it. It's exactly. Just, it's really annoying. And there's nothing you can do now, but you are in a better position than both of us. You can keep them on, wear your retainer, and have beautiful, straight teeth. Mm -hmm. Um... Dude's like, when I get them off, can I get them whitened as well? So like, he'll literally be like gleaming. Oh, yeah, Elsie does as well. These are quite straight now. Yeah, they look Hold on, but she's different. got this gap in the middle, which is really sweet. But uh -huh. I think they'll close it. But yeah, your teeth are doing really well. Yeah. So I like. I used to not think like like even when my teeth when I didn't have braces, I used to think my teeth weren't that bad. And then I like just look at my pictures of myself and we smile. I can see that they are actually quite. Yeah. They're not severely bad, but like you can see that they were quite different. So having braces isn't just like what your teeth look like. It's about like preserving your teeth and making yeah. sure that you can bite down and you know just hopefully having healthy teeth forever. Oh my god, look at him! Do you know he's so angry? So, these guys are watching some Tom and Jerry, aren't you? Yeah. Um, Jean and Max have gone for a walk. They've taken Jessie for a walk. And Elsie is waiting to get in the bath. You get in the bath, Elsie? Yeah, well, Jude, you haven't cleaned it out yet. Oh, Jude, you need to clean it out. I... Okay, Jude's doing his hair. I just gave Jude an Olaplex treatment. Um, he's Because he's got highlights in his hair, so... Does it feel any different? Yeah. Does it? Does it feel softer? Yeah. Yeah. Drew probably takes the longest time doing his hair in this house, longer than me. Do you agree? Yeah. I think, I, th so I actually think that curls can actually take longer sometimes because you need to get them exactly right. Um, where are you else? Yeah. Are you reading? The Lottie Project by Jackie Wilson. It's your favourite author, isn't it? Yeah, I love Jackie Wilson. Are you still reading A Wrinkle in Time? Yeah, I'm reading it. I just... Well, We're I'm reading the Book number one. two. Yeah. What's it called? A Wind in the Door. Okay. Are you enjoying it? Yeah, it's all right. Do you prefer that, though? Yeah, I, I just love Jackie Wilson's books. For pleasure? Yeah. Yeah. This is a book that I set for Elsie to read. Um, I do like it. It's just something confusing at some points. It's just a really odd book. Yeah, Jean said that, but it's, it's supposed to be really good. Yeah, and it's it supposed good. to be a good book, like, for your age group to read Elsie and Max are both reading these books, aren't you? Yeah, and Max, Max is on the book first one. one. He literally like started it like the other day. Um, guys, I don't know if I've shown you actually. So um, they now have this cubby hole thing on the wall. Um, just trying to add some space. Sorry, the light's a bit bad. And then this is Jean's sort of she study area. Right yeah, all of her subjects. And then she has a desk. And the chair, the lighting's really poor in here, so you can't see. There we go. Oh gosh, it's even worse. But yeah, there's Jean's desk. <laughs> There's Jean's desk, the new storage bits and bobs and bats and etc. So yeah, just trying to make the most of the small space. Yeah. Um, Jean and Max have gone to take Jess for a Jean walk. Like I know, they just left, didn't they, about Sorry. asking anyone. There he is, Jesse, come here. Jesse, oh he's good. Hello, hello handsome. Yeah, it's actually, it's actually really cold. I'm really cold and it looked kind of sunny out so I didn't think it would be this cold so I just put um, this on but I kind of wish that I did bring my coat because I am pretty cold. Oh, I love taking Jess out on walks. He is, he's a really good boy on walks guys. He, um, so when he was a puppy he used to run away, you know, he used to go over to other dogs, people and now he's really good he's really good with people and he is slowly getting there with dogs but he's just he's doing so well he's such a good boy
that is everything. Guys, I apologize for the bad lighting in advance. It's getting dark so much earlier and in this house in particular, I rely so much on natural light. Um, anyway, I have laid out all the food on um, the table. Don't forget I am like lacking in about 30 key ingredients, a lot of like my proteins and things. Um, I did also take out a huge section um, for a video we're doing tomorrow. Super exciting one, so don't forget to check back for that. Anyway, I'm just gonna get on and do a mini haul for you all and let you see some of the things we picked up this week. So here we have some greenery, some romaine, some spinach, some rocket, um, some broccoli. These are really small. I could literally eat that one to myself. Um, yeah, but that's, that's all I got got two cucumbers, um, six avocados. There is a lot of plastic packaging. This is just how it comes here. It's, yeah, it's not great. Um, mixed peppers, two red peppers. Um, I've got some marmalade. Um, I've got some like uh, icing, um, biscoff, um, like biscuit spread. These are like baking bits basically. That's for my birthday. My birthday, which is on Saturday, um, I'm going to be making myself a cake. Um, Jean did offer, but I wanted to do it in some like bite. I think that's bicarb. We've got two organic pitters, like packets of um, brown pitters. Got some yogurts, uh, some frozen blueberries, some frozen strawberries. I'm just taking you along the front. Um, some onions, some mixed frozen vegetables, two packets of like French fries, uh, a melon two papayas, lots of apples back there, green and just like Rayburn, I think they are. Um, some flour, it's again for baking. We've got three packets of um, Linda McCartney vegetarian sausages, three packets of, um, this isn't bacon, this is actually really nice bacon. Do you like that? Yeah, it's really yeah, nice. Yeah, it's nice bacon. Um, I've got some hoisin. I like to do like hoisin and black bean tofu, which is lovely. Oh yeah, that's really it's nice, isn't it? Some garlic bread, some oats, some potatoes, some uh, pen pasta, some spaghetti, um, two big jars of um, passata, some chopped tomatoes. Now, I ordered a lot of tin beans and a lot of them didn't come. I do have some in the cupboard, but this is all they sent me. So that's two um, aduki beans one black bean is that one black bean no two black beans yeah it's not that much a packet of basmati rice some decaf tea everyone loves a tea here got some sweet corn i love sweet corn you don't do you else i do i do like sweet corn oh no you do but a lot of the others don't like sweet no, corn i don't know why they don't like especially sweet corn. like when it's on the cob though yeah. i know it's like the same but the still yeah eating like it straight from like the cob that. um just some chili powder for um chili Marmite, because we are uh, we are a marmite loving family. Got some um, mixed seeds um, to go on top of like a casserole making. Um, Elsie seems to be okay with seeds when they're like cooked on yeah. top or for a really long time on top of something. But sometimes, if it's like, like if yeah. I eat sunflower seeds, yeah, or if you had it in like cereal or something like a yeah. muesli, then she would. I get it. She yeah, she would stuff. be affected. Um, uh, some mushrooms. We've got four packets of silken tofu. We use these in like smoothies and smoothie bowls. This type of tofu is the kind of one I like to make um, a tofu scrambled. I did order another one um, to make the hoisin um, tofu, but that's the one that didn't come. Got a packet of bagels. I'm sure I ordered two of those. Got some bananas. It looks like a lot, but they will be gone <laughs> in seconds. Um, got some falafels there to go in the pita bread, so like falafel and salad. Got quite a few of those. Got some vegan cheese and two packets of crisps. Yeah, so it's actually not that much. Obviously it fills the table, but there is eight of us. It's not that much at all if you think about it. Obviously I do still have some food in the freezer and in the cupboards, but I don't have a lot of, an awful lot of storage space. So I can't really like um, stockpile. I mean, it's not something that I would do, but obviously with a large family, it's nice to have some things like pre-made or just have a bigger freezer to be able to buy for longer periods of time. And I just don't have that. So I do have to shop quite frequently because we just don't have the space. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed that little food haul. I am going to end the vlog here, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please give it a big thumbs up. Like, actually do it. 
give it a thumbs up if you liked it um give it a thumbs down if you didn't like it if you want and um subscribe if you're new around here we'd love to have you join our little corner of the internet and we will see you all again very soon bye guys <laughs>